Okay, we first flew into San Juan, Puerto Rico, and then we hopped on a 25-minute flight to Vieques. Our pilot was amazing. She was uh, probably one of the best pilots I've ever experienced in my life. Uh, never been on a small plane this size, and it was an experience. I tell you that. I think everyone should experience this. We then uh, went to our resort. We got a cab to our resort. Uh, actually, we shared an Uber with um, the gentleman who flew on the flight with us. There were only three people on the plane and uh, we stayed at the blue moon resort look at these pool views guys it was amazing we had a wonderful fabulous time every morning waking up to this amazing sunrise and this a beautiful weather it's about 80 degrees 80 80 to 85 degrees daily uh, we had mimosas every morning by the pool we actually had the whole pool to ourselves at this resort uh here's uh, a trip we took over to um black sand beach and you can see that was an experience in itself um gotta be honest i could probably do without that next time but yet and still it was really good to kind of see the uh black sand it was it was something to, to a sight to see uh we had a good time there uh just be cautioned that when you do decide to go to black sand beach it is a about a mile and a half walk down to you get to the beach uh, but it's it's amazing good scenery along the way and this is actually a bar right uh, near uh, the airport. So soon you step off the plane, if you want to start your drinking and have a cocktail before a um, local bar right there, very reasonably priced, but don't expect it to be top shelf. Uh, wow. Here we go. One thing you will notice about Vieques, there are horses and chickens just walking around like regular people throughout the uh, actual uh, island and uh, no lights on this island, by the way, as well. Here's some more shots of our amazing amazing pool we really enjoyed this resort i would highly recommend blue moon resort um it's more of a hands-off resort where what i mean by that is people aren't going to bother you people are probably not going to come up to you and necessarily offer you drinks although our waiter there the second day amazing young man came up and gave us um some mimosas complimentary for that fact and um he was very very pleasure to meet him kind of gave us this little story and everything but uh, very polite everyone on this property uh, was polite. Um, I can't say enough about the uh, the staff at uh, Blue Moon Resort. We had a wonderful, fabulous time. Um, if you are thinking about going to Vieques, I can definitely tell you um, this is a great place to stay. Uh, they're like cottages. They're pro probably about five or six cottages, and that's our one of our um, cottages there. Uh, that's the main entrance there. But our cottages, you know, kind of like a, a regular room, but uh, very cozy and, and, and kind of uh, honeymoonish like, um, but very beautiful. But I cannot say enough about this scenery. Just to wake up to this every morning was, it was an amazing feat. And uh, my wife and I were celebrating not only going to a wedding, but our nine, nine year anniversary. So that was kind of double the, the pleasure. So um, we had a wonderful time. It was just really a time for us to just kind of unplug and just kind of relax and, and, and just kind of enjoy the, the weather. My wife is a beach bum, so she loves sun anytime she can get it. And I tell you, the sun did not disappoint on this trip here. I would highly recommend uh, you definitely need to take the commuter flight. Do not fly into San Juan and then take the ferry because what you're going to be faced with is a 40 minute drive in an Uber or cab to get to the um, pier uh, to catch the ferry, which then is another 55 minute uh ferry ride uh just to get to Vieques. So I say save the time, save the save yourself the travels and save the heartache and just go ahead and get that commuter flight. Um because you're going to fly into San Juan and then your 25 minute commuter flight right into Vieques. It is a beautiful experience to be on a small commuter plane like that. Gotta admit it felt like I was flying on a private plane. Hashtag I've never flown on a private plane, but <laughs> that really felt good. But this is look at this amazing beach here. This is kind of us entering into uh, Black Sand Beach and just kind of walking down about a mile and a half and then kind of entering to the beach. Again, beautiful scenery. Um, I would say see for yourself. Uh, great views, but I probably would pass on that next time. But it was kind of cool to see uh, the Black Sand. And that was amazing. I, I've experienced that in another island on uh, we, we took a trip to St. Kitts years back. But um, nonetheless, you know, I, I think it's, you know, to each his own, you know, um, it's worth the worth the to try to just kind of see it for yourself. But uh, guys, we had an amazing time in Vieques celebrating a uh, family member's wedding. And uh, the wedding was just amazing. The venue was all that. And then some probably the best 
venue on the whole island of Vieques. So uh, again, I just kind of want to show you guys some scenery and just so you can kind of look and see the water was amazing, felt amazing. Now, I will caution you, we did not um, uh, go into the beach near our hotel. Uh, there wasn't a lot of beach space there. Uh, there was some small beach space, but we uh, the tide was kind of kind of rough because it is hurricane season over there. So we kind of opted out and <laughs> selected not to to try that. Um, but still beautiful. We did get a chance to put our feet in the water and feel the water was amazing. Um, not too cold at all. Great temperature, but we just enjoyed ourselves by the poolside and it was um, it was just exactly what we needed uh, just to kind of unplug. Um, I can definitely tell you it is worth the trip if you're looking for a an opportunity just to kind of get away um not a not a a long flight um i think we were about three and a half hours from dc to san juan and then another 25 minutes to fly on the island of Vieques. but beautiful island um this was the local store there it's called the green store um in spanish <laughs> but uh they have all your needs there we alcohol drinks uh water you know certain types of um food comfort food etc that was cool there and there's my wife and i just kind of enjoying the scenery again she is uh she is all about the sun and um it was uh amazing you know we got blessed with great weather i mean every day i think it may have rained one day around two o'clock in the morning but we were already back at our um at our room at the resort though but uh this is that path i was kind of talking about if you want to take that trip down to black sand so if I have to rate this and give this a, a Kizan score, I would, if it, when I'm rating everything on a five, I would give the island a four. I would give the service a four. I would give the beaches a four. And I would definitely, definitely give the, the travel with the arrangements a five. We had a wonderful time. Guys, take your ladies or girls, take your guy to VHS. It was amazing. And I'm telling you, um, you would come back feeling like, wow, I didn't have to travel all day to go witness something beautiful.